Hey guys, Furious Technology. What I have here is the OtterBox Defender Series case for the iPhone 6, one of the most popular cases out on the market today. I'm going to be doing an unboxing and a little bit of a demo of it on my phone. So first things first, let's take it apart. So there's a little flap right here on the back, pretty straightforward, that just flops right open. Um, it's very plasticky packaging. Probably not environmentally safe, but that's okay. That's just the way that uh, OtterBox has always packaged their stuff. So we're just going to pull the case right out and we'll put the packaging aside there. The case will just sit right in and um, as you might have noticed, it is sitting on a little clip. So we will take it out and I will show you that. So it is on an actual clip right there. So we'll pop the case out first. I'll show you that little clip as well. So for the clip, it swivels back and forth just like that, and it will also clip. It is a nice strong clip. Um, I know there's a lot of problems with the older OtterBoxes with that clip breaking, uh, but this one does look quite strong, and OtterBox obviously will warranty that if it does break when you buy it. So the case itself, so as you might notice, it does have a screen protector built right into the case. It does have um, a little plastic cover right here, which will allow you to use that Touch ID as well. Um, this is not open, but one thing I will show you later on, what you can do to get that open there. So on the back of the case, Nice durable rubber type of material. You've got all your openings and all that. And I'll show you some more of that in a second here. So we'll take the case apart. So all you need to do is basically just put your nail on there and you just kind of peel around. And this is that rubber part that's just around the case itself. And so that's your durability wise when you're dropping it right there. And then that's your skeleton piece right here. So it does have quite a few clips all around the side of it. So what we'll do is we'll take some of those clips out right away. So it is quite difficult, but if you can get your nails underneath those clips, then you can just get it out enough where you can just pull it apart. On the inside, it does have some nice padded piecing right here. And then this is also an actual screen protector. So it will show off your Apple logo. So We'll take my iPhone 6, so I've got the white one, so it probably doesn't look the greatest in the black case, but um, we're gonna do what we uh, have here, work with it. And so I'll just flop the phone right into there, and then we'll grab this piece right here. You wanna make sure you probably wanna wipe it off and, and all that before you put it on. Um, for now, for time being, I'm just gonna leave it. Uh, the other thing I was talking about, actually, I'll go over is you can see this little plastic piece right here, which covers up um, and it uh, will protect your phone as well. Um, I've noticed that if you take this piece off, and it's actually very easy to take off, you can see you can just peel this piece off and just take it right off. It'll actually make your Touch ID a lot easier to use. Um, for the time being, I'm just gonna leave it on there for now though. And we'll take the actual phone, and to put the case on, we'll just flop it right on top right there. And now you just wanna press all the way around, all the edges, snap all those pieces in that you can and make sure it's nice and tight in there. So it's going to be really, really hard to get those pieces back off because once you put the phone in, it does make that case a lot tighter inside to, to get those plastic pieces off. Um, we'll take that rubber piece now and we'll just push that rubber piece in. And then all you want to do is just go around all the edges and then push to get that on and make sure you put all those pieces in as well. So there we go. So looks like I've got it on properly now and we'll just see how well it works. You can see it works perfectly fine. Touch ID works perfectly fine as well. And uh, there you have it. I'll, I'll go around kind of to show you the buttons as well. So your power on and off switch right there. Um, it's a little bit harder to press, but that's okay. That's durability right there. And uh, your mute on and off switch right there covered and then your buttons are nice and covered as well and then on the bottom we do have some openings for your speaker and your microphone no problems and then your charging port as well which is covered and we'll pull that out and show you right there so that's easy to get to it's just a little bit more fussy to pull that off and then plug your charger in but uh, if you want a durable case that's how it's going to be and also you can see that there's an opening right there for your headphone jack 
So there you have it. Um, that's just going to be your unboxing. Um, I'm going to be doing a durability test for this as well. So stay tuned, subscribe to my uh, videos um, or check out my other videos. I might have it posted already and it's going to be a durability and drop test for this. So iPhone 6 OtterBox Defender Series case. Questions, comments, leave them below. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.